to this channel today happens to be your first time please subscribe to the channel like the video and comment at the comment section that is after watching the video you comment at the comment section bishop sam david is going to take us through the importance the spirituality the mysteries of peacock so many of you might know peacock but you might not know the spiritual aspect of it how it is used the feathers of it how it is used let's go check out the video uh peacock is money making machine that is why in the olden day you see that peacock is mostly found in the aintiatic palace why because there is a secret in that anytime you see peacock dancing anytime you see peacock dancing it means the spiritual world god want to manifest money from the spiritual to the physical so when the peacock finish finishes dancing you go and fetch the sun where it was standing before danced you go and fetch that you fetch where the peacock dances put it in a red calico or red cotton or red cloth tie it and put it in your money box automatically this man yes okay i'm not here for peacock i'm here for the feathers let me go quickly if there is somebody that enter trouble every day that involves troubles every day you are in your car small time accident you go out people insult you you find yourself in petty petty uh, 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 how do you call it issues why don't you get the feather of peacock one put it in your pocket everywhere you go that problem will be solved if you build a house and the house is cracking cement is not good you use cement the same thing you don't want the house to collapse easily you pick a peacock you put it at the vantage point of the house before they build it it makes the house stay for longer time listen to me attentively do you have a student i will teach you this evening and you get angry i'm going to teach you this evening and you get angry who say i should stop teaching i will teach you and you get angry i will teach you and you'll be hungry and you go and eat I will teach you this evening. Relax and watch. Do you have a student? That student has a particular subject which he or she found it difficult to study. It could be mathematics, it, it could be science, it could be social studies, it could be biology, it could be physics, it could be chemistry. That your daughter or son find it difficult to study. Well, when, even when he study it, it is difficult for him to get it. Relax. That subject will be the best of all. Go and get a peacock, the feather of a peacock. The feather of a peacock. Ah. Put it in the middle of that subject that the person studied. Put it in the middle for the person. Always the peacock should be there. It should be in the book for, the, for your daughter or son. Yet he continued to study it. That subject will be the best subject among other subjects. I am telling you. Maybe you, I'm telling you, if you like, go and do it. If you don't like, okay, be there. Are you in the wilderness? Are you in the desert? Are you in a forest? That snakes come to you always. Snakes come to the house. Or you, let me tell you, first of all, if you put peacock in your, your pocket, snake does not come to you. Take that one or leave it. Number two, if a house is there and snake comes inside, you put the peacock at the entrance of your gate, the snake will not come. Relax. A husband is watching me. A wife is watching me. Every day there is this petty petty argument. Cow, 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 cow. Who now come you? Me na ma cow. Only the slightest thing. 
misunderstanding. Not controlling self. Lack of maturity. Lack of communication. When it's set in a marriage, there is a disaster. Every day there's confusion. A dear be a new one. Bermano be ya. A be your banned it. A dear be a new one. Or banu be ya. A be your bermaned it. In that case, Tamuchuku, relax. Get two feathers, two. Don't make mistake. Don't make mistake. Me see me betcha wa diama. Ubofu. Me betcha wa diama. Koma di. Tilipa. Get two feathers. Two feathers of peacock. Ubi be visa se manya wani pa koma ke tu beto bi. Koni fio benye bi. There are other big big people they have it. Two feathers of peacock. Put it under your bed. Don't pray. There is a prayer. I pray. But this one don't pray. Even if you want to pray, pray that this direction should not work. It will even work better for you. Relax. Put it under your bed. Leave it there. The problem will be solved automatically. You are working and they are paying you every day, but you find it difficult to save money. They give you money. You know the salary is worth, but you find it difficult to save money. And you have fasted for so many times. No. Get a pick up feather one. Put it in your wallet. Simple. Where you save money, you will not even know yourself. Maybe the Bishop Dr. Sandu. I am still re receiving information from the one who sent me. Whether you like it or not. And I'm going to teach you. And I will teach you too. Amen. Okay, let's continue. There are messages coming. Keep your message. Let me know where you are watching me from. Let me know. Keep the message coming. Let me know where you are watching me from. Make sure you share it as, as many as you can. As many as you can. Make sure you share it to people. Make sure this message reach people. Yes. You have a shop. Relax. And at the end of the day, when you sell, your expectation is not being met. Your expectation is not being met. I mean, the profit is not mad. Relax. Get a pickup. Get a pick, the feather of a pickup. Hang one at the entrance of your store. <laughs> Put one in your money bowl. Your money bowl. The expectation will be met. Relax. When you hang it, maybe people will think that it is juju because they are baby Christian. Lack of knowledge, my people perish. So you can hide it a little at the entrance. Maybe you. Evil eye always keep watching you. Do you tell me the evil eye are always watching you? Evil eye. People need prune. People are jealous about you. Evil eye. And you pray and pray and pray. You pray and pray and fast. Your prophet intervene. Your bishop intervene. But it's still not proving right positive. Just do this for me. Just do this for me. Get a peacock. Anytime you are moving, make sure you put it in your pocket. And tell me again. Look, there are people, there are people said that has power, okay? There are people, let me tell you. If you go to a Sumbia, or there is some religion, uh, 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 the Hare Krishna people, some of them understand this. They understand the power of the peak of feathers. So whenever somebody, uh, uh, the, the person is there and he has no friends. When friends come, they pay the person with evil. When he comes, they pay him with evil. Those people understand the secret of feathers. So they tell you to bring a pick up feather. 
When they bring it, they let you recite. Hari, Hari, Hari Krishna, Hari, Hari Krishna, Hari. They let you recite on it. Then they let you to put it on you. For people to love you and appreciate you, adopt you into the society, they know the power in people. Feathers. Anyway, as I'm speaking now, somebody say, Can I reach my turn? Because my house, they came to plant something in my house. And it's giving us diseases. Put pick up feathers into holy water and sprinkle it. Use it to sprinkle it all over the house. It will kill that power. Number two, if you don't have a holy water, you can get the, the middle of palm, not it seven. Put it in water. Add pick up feathers. Use it to sprinkle. You have killed the spirit. What are you talking about? What are you saying? What are you talking about? No. Anybody watching me is having a bad dream. All the way when he's sleeping, sleep, he had a bad dream. The person don't even sleep to have a peace of mind. You don't sleep. <laughs> you have a bad dream. Get a pickup feather tomorrow. Go and buy it at market. Put it in your pillow. You will sleep like a baby. You will enjoy your sleep. You will dream good dream. Nice dream. You will enjoy it. I am telling you. Okay. You want to marry. You are single. People come to you. And then they are disappointing you. One thing I would tell you is to check your character. If you feel your character is okay, good. Pregnant, a character is like pregnancy. It cannot be hidden, but it will be exposed. But you cannot measure. You cannot. They say the sword does not praise himself. You cannot know. You cannot determine. So let, if you are a, a lady, let guys assess you. Those guys that have disappointed you, who came back to become your friend, should assess you. They will tell you a hidden secret that you don't know. The same applies, vice versa, the same applies to the guys. Okay. But if things be equal and you are okay, master, do this for me. You'll be putting your ear, anytime you hear a marriage talk, that they are going to give a talk on marriage. I am telling you to get a new car at that moment. I am saying your character because when you get a new car, one week, two weeks is going to be out from your hand. Wear a new dress and go to the marriage talk. As you are going, get a people into your pocket. Master, you cannot come back without men having the mind to get access to you. <laughs> ah. Don't kill peacock, or it's not good. When you are going and you see peacock on your way, ash, it is a sign of good luck. It is a sign of good luck. It tells you where you are going will be prosperous. Peacock feather, bring luck, bring power, bring fortune, bring fame, popularity. Let me tell you some, some, some secrets. When you go to the fetish priest or the shrine, most of them draw or drew peacock dancing on their walls. Plenty, and you fear them. There is no force behind it. Too. There is no power behind it. Too. Let me tell you something. Anybody that have a drawing of a peacock on a car, on a building, it scares the devil away. It's automatic. It scares the devil away. Mm. If anybody is sick, you have to work. Keep peacock at the southeast. 
in the room of the person. The person will get here. Promise Atta or see, hello, bro. Why can I find you? Wow. My place is Sam Sam Junction. S A M S A M. It is even running under. When you are coming from I am in Accra, when you are coming from Achimota, pick a car as if you are going to Insawum, but don't get to Insawum. You alight at Sam Sam Junction. After the tow boot, the third jump back stop, that is Sam Sam Junction. But when you're coming from Kumasi after Insawum, you get to Media, Media to Gao Gao, Gao Gao to Sam Sam Junction. That is where you find me. Thank you for watching the video. That was because I'm David taking us through the spirituality and the mysteries of Peacock. You heard so many things that he said, both physical and spiritual, practical and theory. So whatever you might have heard before, whatever you might not have heard before, put down your comment at the comment section. If you understood, put down your comment. If you did not understand, put down your comments. Some of whatever he's saying are practical and you can put them into practice and then test them, see whether it is true or not. These are some of the spiritualities or mysteries about peacock and its feathers. Most of you might know the spiritual or mysteries aspect of the feathers of peacock. So for that matter, you can elaborate it further for somebody who couldn't understand to understand it at the comment section. Let's discuss at the comment section. Any analysis, any assessment, anything you want to say, anything you want to elaborate, let's do that at the comment section. Thank you for sticking and staying and enjoying the video. I'm going to come away with another video some other time.